Welcome back to the prop shop, everyone. Thanks for dropping by for February's 3D model, which is, you guessed it, another big ass sword. For those of you who may be new, I am Overedge Props, and I am a cosplay prop maker and rookie 3D modeler. I mainly focus on anime and VTuber weaponry, so if you're into that sort of thing, you are in the right place. Now, this blade of beauty is wielded by the self proclaimed lone monster slaying superhuman goofball and twitch vtuber austin yeed with four e's now like with kai's video last month i unfortunately don't know much about austin's lore or backstory so i will try to keep my audio portion as brief as possible i've seen austin in the hocus chat a lot recently and previously saw his art sometime i think last year during someone else's art stream and was reintroduced to his art recently in Nahoko's art stream. Upon seeing the art again, I immediately had sword on the brain. Now I was going to 3D model it last year when I first saw it, but I felt my skills weren't up to par yet to tackle something like this. The main reason is the leather wrapping. Trying to figure out how exactly to get it to look wrapped in Fusion 360 felt like a huge challenge and honestly it still was even today but i think i did a decent job with it considering everything i've learned with fusion 360 itself now i am a little bit upset that some of my recording was lost thanks to ovs having a brain fart and stopping the recording but you know we push on now normally i would just re-record that portion but since it was the leather wrapping and that had so many different functions and was just a lot of trial and error, I decided just to cut my losses and continue on. I've done a little bit of tweaking with the settings for OBS, so hopefully it won't happen again in future videos. But who knows, it seems like I'm cursed as of lately. This was a really fun project, and honestly it was a much needed challenge considering how difficult this month has been already. I definitely needed my creative outlet to help take my mind off some stuff. But, you know, tomorrow's a new day, and hopefully things will get a little easier moving forward. As always, I will be linking Austin's information down below. You'll find links to his Twitch channel and his Twitter, as well as my Twitter and my future Twitch channel. So that way you can keep up with Austin, you can keep up with me, and honestly, if you follow me, you're going to see a lot of anime and a lot of VTuber stuff, so... You've been warned as of right now because VTubers and artists are some of my favorite content creators in the world and I will keep singing their praises until I am six feet in the ground. So if you're into that thing, go ahead and give me a follow. Thanks again for stopping by and showing your support. Please drop a like and or comment down below and subscribe if you're not already. As I stated before, I will be doing at least one 3D model a month for the entire year. And even if I do start streaming, I will try to do edited VODs here on YouTube, so that way you can still see what I was working on. I hope you enjoy, and I'll catch you again next month. Take care, everyone.